Hey Metropolites, welcome to a chat with Matt. A Matt in a shirt. I mean, look at this. It's Nan's little what, eh? Yeah, um, basically it's my Nan's 80th birthday today, so we've been celebrating with lots of cake. And I know, I am pretty full. So yeah, dress up for the occasion. It's not like me. I'm the kind of guy that opens the cupboard, grabs a shirt, t-shirt, just go out. Obviously with trousers or shorts as well. Anyway guys, so today I want to show you some of my new pickups and I want to reveal my new microphone to you. Boom. And my new intro to you as well. Never boom. So yeah, um, I love intros and I kind of want to get several intros so I can use them here and there, mix and match, so my channel doesn't seem to get repetitive in a way. Um, of course, I've got some intros already for certain series, such as Gimme Goosebumps, uh, Marine Boy. Um, I know there's another one. Well, I got a few. But um, then I got my generic ones I use for just general stuff. So yeah, guys, without further ado, I am now going to reveal to you my new intro. So guys, there it is, bow down. So let me know what you think of that. Yep, Lion King inspired. Love the music, and it took me ages to get it spot on to like kick in when, um, is it Rafiki? Well, yeah, Rafiki holds up my logo. So that's one new intro, and there is another one, which will be series specific, coming up. So let me know what you thought about that intro in the comments below, guys. Um, yeah, my other intro, um, I'm basically making a special video which requires a lot of voiceover work. So, with that in mind, and it could turn into a series, I went and I purchased myself a Snowball Blue Ice microphone. Look at that, it looks pretty professional, doesn't it? I feel like a DJ or something. So yeah, the quality on this is well, so far, absolutely awesome. I really, really like it. <clears throat> and excuse me, my voice is going. But yeah, um, I've only used it once so far. I've recorded the introduction to the special video. I want to tell you what it is, but I don't want to spoil it either, so I'm not going to. And yeah, it comes out pretty well. Um, I did voiceover work on my introduction to Marine Boy, the anime video. And that came out not so great, the audio, because I was using my PlayStation headset. But this little baby... Is great. Maybe I can start my singing career as well. Crazy, crazy for feeling so lonely. Nah, no. Better than some people on the X Factor, I can tell you. Right then, let's get to some pickups. Um, kind of all cartoon related today. So I can't remember if I showed you guys this recently, so forgive me if I have, but I went out. Actually, I didn't go out. I went on eBay and I purchased myself Earth from Jim the Complete Series on DVD. So that'd be great watching that again. I used to watch that as a kid. Love the video games. Uh, love the intro. Earth from Jim. Da -da 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 -da. Excuse me. So yeah, that'd be great to watch again. Starring Dan Castellaneta. If I said I, Castellaneta. Voice of Homer Simpson. It is Homer Simpson, yeah. It says on the back. Awesome. Um, right, next two pickups were sent to me by my cousin. Um, he was going for our auntie's house and basically found some old toys in a crate that he used to have as a kid years ago. And he messaged me asking, do I want them? And I thought, yeah, why not? The first one up, we've got Frottle from Biker Mice on Mars. Um, I've already got this guy, but I thought, yeah, go on, have another one. Why not? Oh, antenna has been chewed a bit. The thing we get up to his kids, eh? Yeah. I've actually got all the biker mice. I've got all the other two. Modo and Vinny. There you go. The original biker mice series was awesome. Um, I've got the bikes as well. I've got some of the bad guys. I've never watched the new series. They brought it back. Was it early 2000s? Maybe later. I can't remember. 
But yeah, so that's throttle. And then, now this is going to be obvious to some of you, it is a toad from back your hair. Yes, I've already got a toad, but he's cracked down the middle. So there's a huge crack in his chest. So I now call him my battle hardened toad. And um, also, I'll be getting another one of these because uh, Interghost messaged me saying he picked one up at a cardboard sale. Would I like it? Because he knows I love back your hair. And I thought, well, because Toad is not a specific character, there's an army of Toads, why the hell not? So now I'll be having three Toads in total when that arrives. So to create a little army against the mammals, back your hair and his crew. So yeah, there's the Toad. Much better condition than what I got. So yeah. Obviously they haven't come with the weapons and accessories, but trying to match them in toy crates now that my cousin was going through. Impossible. There's so many little plastic weapons and stuff. You'd have to really um, research on Google to find out what went with those figures, and I don't mind that. My last pickup was something I didn't know existed. We have a Buck Your Hair giant sticker fun book. Sticker book. Basically, this is a sticker book slash coloring book, and... It's got the stickers on the inside there and in the middle pages. It basically, it basically says press up stickers, moisten and place them on the pages where they belong. Finish your picture of crayons. So we've got certain scenes like here and you can see this bit on my finger. It's all greyed out. That's where one of the stickers will go. So you've got to match them up and then you can colour the rest in. Um, so here's some of the stickers right here. So you've got Jenny's face, you've got Bucky's hand. Got Jenny's breast, okay, <laughs> and a lot more. You got parts of the toad ship by there. Yeah, and you got some more. They recognize Bucky and Blinky, Willy Do It, Bruiser's arms, Bucky's cape. Man, so yeah, that was pretty cool. That this came from America, and the seller, um, he charged me too much of postage. But he was that honest that uh, when he went to post the item, it would go weighed up. He gave me a £7 discount then, a uh, refund. So cheers for that, mate. I really appreciate that, even though you probably never watch this video because you don't know who I am. But still, it's great to know that there's people out there that will do that for you. And when I messaged the guy and I said, oh, thank you for the uh, refund, you know, it was really good of you. He said, like, out of 100 people, I was only, like, the second or third person to ever thank him for doing that. So I thought, Phew. you know, appreciation. There's got to be more appreciation in this world. Boom. So, yeah, that's all I got for you now, guys. Hope you enjoyed the intro and the rest of this video. And as ever, stay strong. Boom. See you soon. Do -do -do -do.